Good afternoon. It's Friday. Time falls out. It's time to jump on the bandwagon and make a day one recording of yourself. Play Timefall, which I have previously played the beta and I played about six hours and I tremendously enjoyed it and people were like warning me like oh it's just more of the same from the beta look out it's but I, I like the beta and I, I just I just really wanted to play more of that really so um, I'm quite happy to fork over the money and keep playing because I'm a slave to the machine help no. So this is new. I haven't seen this before. It's a cutscene. It's probably explaining something plot significant that I'm missing because I'm gabbing over it. There's maybe some kind of... Okay, so we've made it into space. We've definitely made it into space. There's some kind of okay. So there's some kind of fight over energy, and that's why the game is happening. Maybe. There's nothing I like more than lots of cutaway shots of robots being built. That's my favorite. So this game is is definitely already a ten out of ten. Well, that was nice. Oh, there we go. That's what I was looking for. <laughs> so, um, in the beta, once you got into a lobby, there was... Oh, no, wait, no. Now we're doing... Sorry, we're doing the training now. How could I have forgotten? We got to go over the training first. I might just cut this out, to be honest, because, you know, training. All right, finally. Christ. You really would have thought they would uh, make that one through. Okay, what have we got? Play classic? I guess that's what I'm going to do. I don't know much about the campaign, but I'll probably check that out on my own time. Do I have any challenges? Because they unlock for some reason. Uh, let's have a look at what we got. Um... Do we have any? Do we have? Can we? I guess we can't make any like actual loadouts yet. Although I do remember that being the case in the beta. Yeah. All right. I guess we're just gonna go in with uh, attrition, which is basically the classic team deathmatch thing. Wow, look at all that. Oh man, these guys probably think they're gonna like take me apart. They probably are gonna pull me apart, actually. So, as we are saying just before the fucking training thing started, um, I was hoping that they would have cut down the time that you get when you join, like the amount of time it takes to get into a game once you join a lobby. But it's like almost a whole minute just sat there staring at people's names. Yeah, so I guess they haven't done that yet. Cool. <laughs> um. mm. The I think the level cap for beta was like 15, and I managed to hit that in the six hours I played. So, I think that, I think that seems about the right amount. I think, I don't know, I think it took me, I got that in like a day. Like I played for a few hours one day. Like I make it sound like I barely played at all, but I did play for quite a long time. 
the the one day I started playing and I got to the level cap for the beta, which was they think six, fifteen. Okay, let's see what we got. Um, I'm not a big fan of the heavy rocket, but the carbine rifle is the best, so All right, boss, this is a battle yeah, I'm just going to go with that. Seems fine. Alright, what's this? This is a map I've not seen before. This is a new map. Hello. How are you doing? You alright? Alright. Seems to be some shooting happening over here. Probably gonna get killed any second now. Any second, someone with a sniper rifle. Oh, hello. Don't think I didn't see you. I saw you. What are these guys doing? They're just kind of hanging out? They're not doing anything with them? Guess not. All right, so that was one of the uh. The basically the friend like the enemy NPCs like there are NPCs in this game and they kind of make up for the like oh it's only six v six which some people are legitimately mad about for some reason come on ah shit that should have been a grenade that was a grenade situation um yeah some people got really mad about the six v six thing I don't really think it affects the game whatsoever. I think 6v6 is quite enough of people in a game like- Oh, this guy hasn't seen me, I don't think. Wait, is he gone? No, there he is. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, stop that. I'd appreciate it if you stop that. Um. I felt like I was going to say something. Oh yeah, um, so I have not played, I'll put my hand up and say I have not played a Call of Duty game for like, since since Modern Warfare 2? Shit. Oh that was a Titan killed me. And I feel like maybe because I haven't played a Call of Duty game in so long that oh, a lot of what makes this game like entertaining to me is like the stuff that they've slowly added. Ooh, that's cool. Wait, is this guy? That guy's an enemy. I'm gonna kick him. Yeah. Um, the stuff that they've slowly added to Call of Duty games, I've just not seen it because I've not been interested in Call of Duty at all. Like, I played the second Call of Duty game and was like, and yeah, this is basically the same shtick sh sh from the last one. And, um, yeah, that was basically it, and I wasn't interested, even though I continued to play Halo games for, let's call down my Titan, uh, a real long time. And I feel like maybe the reason I enjoy this game personally so much is because it's all so new and fresh to me. Um, I mean, of course, you've got the addition of, oh, that's, that's a friendly guy. That's not a friendly guy, though. Neither is that. Um, it's also new and fresh to me. So, and it seems like, you know, and of course you got the addition of the mechs. Obviously, as we're seeing right now. Shit. What's, hit, what's hitting me? Oh, he's hitting me. Hey! Cut that out! Cut! Cut that out! Stop that! Oh! Oh! Did, oh, you hold it. How come I couldn't eject? I was hammering on the X button like no one's business. Oh. Hmm. Um. Yeah, you got the addition of the mechs, but I mean, I do kind of get what people's criticisms of the game are. It's like, oh, it's just gold. It's just Call of Duty, but with some extra stuff. And yeah. But you know, maybe that's enough for some people. Some people don't need a lot more than that. And um, personally, I mean, for me, this is like fucking incredible. I kind of liken it to my first experience with Pokemon 
Heart Gold Soul Silver, where I hadn't played a Pokemon game since Ruby and Sapphire, or Fi no Fire Red Leaf Green, yeah. And the new stuff was so incredible to me because I hadn't seen it, and people were like, "Oh, well, that's not new. That's been in like you know, that stuff was in." Pearl and Diamond, and I was like, well, I haven't really played those, so it was all so new, and everything was so amazing to me, I was like, oh, this is so good. Oh dear. We lost. My team didn't do very well, and neither did I. Well, I killed a few, a good few people, I feel like, for my first go, that was... I'm gonna get... Oh my god, this was a mistake. Jumping out here was a mistake. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Why? Why did I do this? No! Where am I going? Where am I going? Where am I going? Fuck. I thought for a sec I got killed by an NPC, but no. Alright, come on guys, make it. I know you can do it, I believe in you. This guy who the camera keeps clipping through. Come on! Oh, the dropship was even destroyed. Wow. Oh, that's the only guy left. Hey! Look at that. I- oh, wow. That was seven... Seven pilot kills, that's pretty good. Didn't kill any titans, though. That's enough XP to get me to level 2. Cool. Is CQB... That's the one I like. That's the... Shotgun and the Sidewinder and the pistol. There is a... An automatic pistol in this. And when I mean automatic, I mean like, it locks on to people. But I didn't really like that pistol. Cause I just found found myself using it like a regular pistol rather than the way that they wanted you to use it. Because I guess I don't know, I did I guess it just doesn't gel well with my play style, quote unquote, which is to just run around like an idiot and shoot people <laughs> that I see. That's my play style. Man, I really hope that enough people complain about the wait time in lobbies so that they reduce it, because it's so long. I think I I think I heard like a couple people say like mention that on some gaming websites at some point, like, oh the wait time's so long. Anyway, that was a new map I'd not seen before, and that was that was cool. I liked it. It's nice to have some you know, some vari some variation from like the two maps I played over and over during the beta. This looks like a new one as well, I think. Yeah. Although after a while, I'm probably gonna get sick of like, I don't know. I'm probably gonna get sick of all of them after a while, to be honest. All right, let's do the CQB. Yeah. Three, two, one. I can't remember what level the custom loadouts start at, but I don't think it takes too long to get to that stuff. Ooh, alright, where am I going? All enemy this is what kind of thing? Is this is like a factory? Yeah. <laughs> okay, you have some very... Wow, where am I? Some very strong opinions about who's cannon fodder. There's a guy there. Can I get him? Where do you go? There he is. Oh, this is a shotgun! This is a shotgun. I didn't realize that this was a shotgun. I didn't pay enough attention. Oh shit, where am I? Oh, I killed him. Oh man! Shit, this isn't good. I'm not very good with shotguns. Pilot, your Titan will be ready in two minutes. 
Oh, two minutes? That's, that's, that's forever away. I can't wait two minutes. I'm a gamer. I have an attention span of a... What was I saying? Um, <laughs> there's a joke for you. To this. I can really use a shotgun a lot during the beta. Maybe I should have. Oh, that's a titan spawning over there. Excuse me, sir. Sorry. I didn't even realize he was an enemy until I shot him and he died. And I was like, ah. Pilots, tracking slightly behind the enemy right now. Excuse me. Turn this around. Sorry. Impressive streak. Oh wow, I'm getting a kill streak. That's good for me. I'm because I'm really bad at video games. There we go. Was expected to end any mo any moment. Oh, I should have spawned as a Titan. Shit. Oh well. Let's just do this. You got it. Stand by for Titanfall. Man. Shit, I gotta run over to it now. Oh, there it is. All right. Where is everyone? How do you navigate this place as a titan? Oh, like that, I guess. Sorry, dude. Just about squeeze through here. Ha ha ha! Oh shit. <laughs> hey, hey, where'd you go? Guys, <laughs> can't wait for me. Oh. Yo! Whoa! Where am I? Where am I? Oh yeah, you can now, um, by the way. You can cling onto the wall. <laughs> hey, there's a guy. You can cling onto the wall by holding in the left trigger. So I've just clinged onto this wall that I've ejected up onto. I feel like it's giving me a pretty good vantage point. I'm slipping! Hello. That was probably a bad move. Oh shit. Dang. I've never died to, um, oh Christ, an NPC. Um, I don't, don't remember doing so in the beta. It might have happened, and I'm just misremembering it. But um, I mean, they are 
more than enough, I feel, to make the game feel, you know, as busy as it needs to be. And I think more than six people would just make it, like, too much. Like, I think, I feel like some people made that point, like, oh, Jesus. Fuck me. I feel like some people, someone must have made that point, like, too many people in one space would just, like, over, guys. make it absolutely impossible. Because, like, just imagine, like, more than six people in a, in Titans. Like, that would just be ridiculous. On, a t on like, one team. Oh, good, he's, he stepped on me. I wasn't paying attention and he just stepped on me. Alright, got like not many people. A few people still left on the team. Did anyone get on the ship? Guess not. Eh. It's not too bad. Five, f five, five, five. <laughs> Is that enough for level three? Oh. Just slightly not enough. Oh. So yeah, me personally, like, I'm pretty easily pleased, to be honest. You can give me, like, so many game modes, so many weapons, and I'll be happy. I don't need a lot of <laughs> variation. It sounds awful, but um, like I played Halo 2 for forever with the same maps. Like I continue to play Halo 2 after they released like that final map pack, and I play must have played it until like Halo 3 came out basically, and I just like had fun just playing the game with friends and screwing around. Um, I think like that's that's like an important fact to like, like all these people complain like oh there's not enough variation it's all just gonna be the same thing like who are these people that play this stuff like on their own 24 7 like don't you have any friends? If you have friends, then that makes everything more enjoyable if you play it with some friends. And I'm going to have at least one friend to play this with. Maybe, maybe, maybe a couple more, maybe. You can make any game fun as long as, like, you've got someone to play it with you. Even if it's a bad game. Oh yeah, I don't want that because... That's the shotgun. There we go. Okay, this is a battle of attrition. I will say that um I think like just the little things in this game are really cool, like Ooh, what's in here? Anything? Hello? What's happening? Computers? Okay. And the little things in this game are really nice. Um, I really like the subtleties of this game when you run around shooting people in the face. Um, like the jumping in at the beginning of a match, that's really nice. Just a nice little setup, not just like you like you wake up on a battlefield. Because it's much more, um, I guess you could call it realistic though. 
we are playing a game where big robots punch each other. So there's that. But I do like that more than hey. I do like that more than um just waking up like that. I think that's one thing that always kind of bothered me about FPS is, is you just kind of appear on the battlefield and it's like, well, where, where did I come from? Why are we all together? Like, what is, how did we all find, you know, like there, there are sometimes you ask yourself these questions and then you, you say to yourself, shut up, you stupid nerd, just play a stupid game. Um, but I do like that they kind of addressed that in this game. Like they went, all right, so here are the reasons that these two sides are fighting against each other. Here's where you came from and this is why you are friends and enemies. And I do quite like that about this game. Oh, hello. Is he dead? He's dead. Wait. Oh! Jesus. Oh, was that a Titan? No, it wasn't. Wow. It fucking got me. Fuck. Wow. I'm gonna stop going near that window. Specific. Excuse me. Specifically that window. Right. I'm going, I'm going over near that window again. Fucking. <laughs> Ah! Haha! -ha! That's what you get. I can shoot me. Not nice. Don't do it. That's not me. <laughs> No, 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 no. Shit, I'm gonna have to go around. Excuse me, hello. Pick me up, please. Thank you. I do like that a lot. Where's the pilot? Where's the pilot? Where's the pilot? Where's the pilot? Where is he? They always fly up. Well, they sometimes fly up in it. I'm getting. Did you get off? I'm guessing you must have got off. I do really like the. Um... Shoot. You're pressing the wrong button. I get the bumpers mixed up. Come on. Yes! I don't know if you've noticed, but that's kind of my favorite tactic when I'm in the Titan and I'm fighting. Oh, I just crushed someone. Sorry. Um, that's my favorite tactic when I'm fighting another Titan in a Titan. It's just to run straight up to them and just punch them in the face. What are you doing, guy? Come on. You not see me? Damage core online. There's another couple of Titans. Around the corner here somewhere. Oh, this is where I came from. No, you killed him. Did you just fall off the edge or did you just disappear? That was a really bad idea for him to like poke his head over the ledge like that. Do you not realize that I was just gonna see him? We're looking real good, team. 
Guys, come on, I can see you. I can see I can see all of you. What are you doing? Oh. Hello. Oh, he got me. If it had been a couple seconds later. Oh wait, no. I think you can still permanently die when you're the winning team. I think. Maybe. I think we're about to find out. Let's see. Yeah. Permanently dead. The IMC are trying to escape by dropship. I've marked their evac point for you. Take them out before they get away. Yeah, there's just a bunch of nice little things. Like, the epilogue is a cool little, like, oh, you can still kind of win sort of even though you lost and then there's like an extra thing for the winning team to do and an extra thing for the for the losing team to do you know it's just a lot of nice little things I, mean, I can see myself being quite happy playing this game as it is for a little while maybe I'll get a DLC hey I didn't do too badly Wow, I actually did pretty well. Maybe I'll get like a DLC map pack, maybe, if I feel like maybe I want a little bit more variation. I don't know. We'll see how I feel. Anyway. Is somebody... Someone's blaring dubstep. And it stopped. Cool. I have unlocked challenges. Hooray. Um... So yeah, that's Titanfall. It's out now for like everyone on a whole load of platforms. Xbox One, Xbox 360, PS4, I think. And of course, the best version, the PC version. <laughs> nah, it doesn't matter what you play it on. Um, I play it with a fucking Xbox 360 pad anyway, so... <laughs> Um, it's cool. I like it. It's a nice variation on a theme, and it's enough for me to keep me quite happily playing it until something else comes along, and then I might, like, dip back into it. It's been a really long time since I've played, like, a new FPS, so it's a new experience for me, and, uh, it's nice. I like it. Anyway, that's me. That's time for. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.